Hi Virgo, welcome to your reading and this is for Virgo Ascendant. Sun is rising and Venus placement in their chart. Jupiter may resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. Cross watchers, if I describe someone and you know that it is not you, it is not you. Just because you are connecting with a Virgo, you're going to assume that whom I'm describing here is you. Please don't. This is not a personal reading. For... <clears throat> Those of you who's new to the channel, welcome. You might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein I am doing a live streaming. And in the live stream, you can ask me questions. If you missed the live streaming, you can still ask me questions. There's a link in the description box. Click that link. You'll be routed to my page. Type in your questions and then click submit. 500 likes for this video and your next video will be a full reading. So Virgo, if you want to know your lucky numbers and lucky color dated March the 22nd to the 31st, follow me on Instagram. If you also want to know your financial forecast, then follow me on Instagram as well. If you are into twin flame readings, almost personal readings, pick a card and channel messages. Then subscribe to the other channel, Timeless to Row 111. And if you resonate with the reading, congratulations. If you do not resonate with the reading, you can come back to the reading after a week or two. Time is fluid. If you resonate with some bits and pieces of the reading, still congratulations for I am doing a collective reading. So I would appreciate if you can click the like, subscribe, and share. At sa ating mga kababayan, salamat po sa mga nag-subscribe. Um, let's begin. With a page of pentacles your first card this signifies good news if you have a libra placement in your chart um you can watch the libra li libra uh, video because somewhat i can sense here especially for those who have libra placement might as well check that some good news here i know this good news might be, you, you might also be thinking that this goodness is a trick, right? A trickery with the seven of, seven of Swords. If you're going to combine here, you know, this might also be, let's say, um, a warning. So, since this is not a personal reading, I'll check all of the avenues, the visions that I am seeing here first. This is a good news from a person, let's say, who deceived you. Um, tower moment is happening to them. So your wish is fulfilled with the nine of cups. So which means that if this person, of, if you're thinking of a person that truly hurts you, truly kind of take away something from you, your peace of mind, your love, your um, time, energy, what have you, this person is going to get their karma whatever it is that you wished for to happen to them i know it is let's say a bad thing but when you are in a deep hurt you might you know you're you're a person you might think that i wish that you could um you wouldn't feel what i felt right what you did to me i can see here that that is about to happen to that person well for a few numbers of you virgo I can see here that this is a warning, right? Someone is about to give you like a too good to be true um, announcement or a too good to be true invitation, too good to be true transaction. And I can see here that that person might be kind of deceitful, trickery, right? Cheater, you know, a theft. Seven of Wands is a thief in the night right um underhanded or a schemer right this person is very dangerous i can sense here that this person knows really how to mentally manipulate you um and i can also see here that the universe is not is encouraging you to be to stand your ground here right um instead of well, that's the safe way to run, right? 
but for a few numbers of you Virgo you're very courageous right you're very you're very brave so I can see here that you're going to face this person and a tower moment is about to happen when it comes to the tower moment this is destined right this represents chaos right destruction upheaval this person is about to give you trauma for a few numbers of you you already experienced that for a few numbers of you you can sense it right you can sense the trauma there will be an unexpected change um, I can sense here that this person will reveal themselves probably it is because of what you're going to let's say um, see and discover right I can sense here that it might also represent breakup separation could be divorce right it represents either you or your partner or both are going through a difficult or traumatic event that will push your relationship to its absolute limits someone will be triggered someone is going to but the thing here is the irony of it at one point in time whoever wishes for this because the nine of cups is the wish fulfillment nine of cups is like your whatever it is that you thought you know previously it's about to happen and i can see here that with this being said you know that with the chaos that's about to happen someone here i think that this is the delay um well, I can see here there might be a delay here because the sign of Pentacles is really stagnant, right? Not moving. Um, I can also see here that you, if you are already separated with this person, please be patient because I can see here that there might be, you know, something that's this person is going through. And they're having a hard time right now with a ten of wands. I can see here really for a few numbers of you with this separation, with this deceit. I can see here that there are sleepless nights, nightmares, you know, crying at night, stress, anxiety. This person really gives you a lot of mental. This is mental, right? Um, when I said mental, you're a trauma this person is giving you some traumatic experience here but I can see with the six of cups it doesn't mean that this person this person also probably has remorse because they missed you they wish that they didn't you know do what they did is that I hope that you catch the drift grammatically sometimes or not sometimes <laughs> I am incorrect some sometimes I am you know um, politically incorrect but please understand English is not my first language I'm just trying to send a message take it as you will we're all adults here um, you know what I mean with a four of swords right I can sense here that there might be some exhaustion but I can sense here that this person really have are recharging their batteries so that they can approach you with uh, their remorse what I am kind of curious what they did to you with the three of swords and the six of swords they really want to fix things because they know that they hurt you a lot with the tower moment right I can sense with the nine of wands here and the seven of wands they may be a little defensive um, you know see I told you this person it's going to trick your mind there's a lot of manipulations here even if they're going to apologize because I can see here there's some blaming game that is about to happen with a nine of wands they're going to set up boundaries going to set up hey this is not just all my fault right um, this person is going to be very strategic so that they can also let you think that it takes two to tango um, with a ten of swords here I mean ten of uh, once I can see here the lovers and the four of wands. Although this person, see I told you, you might have a Libra placement. Check that Libra reading. You might be connecting with your 
twin flames probably you might say this is a karmic twin flames but i can sense you with a four of wands soon enough this person is going to um pay for what they did to you with the four of wands here i can sense if you are still wanting to be with this person then you're going to end up with this person and they are a changed person you might be connecting here with uh, of course gemini or has a gemini placement in their chart or you have a gemini placement in your chart any water placements here um or your person has a water placement in their chart or you have but this is your reading so if you resonate with this and you want to go in depth you can book a personal reading with me if you're okay with the reading and you just have a question or two there's a link in the description box click that link you'll be right to my page tap in your questions click submit 500 likes for this video your next video will be a full reading thank you so much for watching love and light to you namaste see you on the next reading Goodbye.